After these things and these acts of faithfulness, the king of Assyria came and invaded Judah and encamped against the fortified cities, thinking to, thinking to win them for himself. And when Hezekiah saw that the king had come and intended to fight against Jerusalem, he planned with his officers and his mighty men to stop the water of the springs that were outside the city, and they helped him. A great many people were gathered, and they stopped all the springs and the brook that flowed through the land, saying, Why should the kings of Assyria come and find much water? He set to work resolutely and build up all the wall that was broken down and raised towers upon it, and outside it he built another wall, and he strengthened the Milo in the city of David. And he, also came, and he also made weapons and shields in abundance. And he set combat commanders over the people and gathered them together to him in the square at the gate of the city and spoke encouragingly to them saying, be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or dismayed before the king of Assyria and all the horde that is with him. For there are more with us than with him. With him is an arm of flesh, but with us is the Lord our God to help us and to fight our battles, and the people took confidence from the words of Hezekiah, king of Judah. The truth is, in life, it will look like the enemy or the opposition has more, more money, more support, more verbal support, more physical support, more stuff. And it may look like you, the believer, you don't have as many resources. But as long as you have God's favor, you have all the resources you need. Small church, but you still have all that you need. Small family, but you still have all the love that you need. You see, size has nothing to do with it. All you need is the favor of God. Continue to pray. Continue to rejoice. Continue to seek the face of God, and he will be guiding you into all truth. Listen, don't look at what the opposition has. Look at what you have in your corner, in your house, in your encampment. That's all you need. God is with you, giving you favor, grace, hope, and success.